Hi guys! Welcome back to my channel. My name is Sarah and I'm the beauty author and I actually just got done filming um, this makeup look right here. If you guys can't see it, it's because um, I actually decided to do something more along the natural line. It's actually called my natural makeup look routine. So if you guys are interested in seeing how I put together a more natural makeup look, then feel free to go check that video, video out. I'm hoping it'll be posted already. But um, I wanted to do the second part of this video focusing more on the eyes. And um, the reason why I wanted to do it separate is because this is actually going to be a how-to do a um, winged eyeliner and also how to do a winged eyeliner using a liquid liner. So I know sometimes putting together like a winged liner look or even just using liquid liner in general can be difficult for some of us. I know the very first time I tried doing it, it was definitely a challenge. I was messing up. I was like going to the Mac store asking them for like, you know, help. How do I do this? And it was really hard to learn from somebody. So I just kept practicing and I realized I found a more easier technique for the, those of us who are struggling to, you know, create that look. Um, and so I'm hoping that what I can teach you guys, you guys can try it out, see if it's helpful for you guys um, so that's pretty much it that's really what this video is going to be the focus is going to be about um, and if you guys want to follow along and see how I put together my winged eyeliner look using my liquid liner then feel free to keep watching okay guys so the first thing I want you guys to know is that um, I did purchase my all of my products out of my own pocket so if you guys are wondering no nobody did not send me anything i purchased everything out of my own pocket so um as far as like what type of liners i like to use if i want to be really precise i like to use um a more uh skinnier very um thin liquid brush and um the one that i actually really recently started loving um this is like my all-time favorite um, it's the L'Oreal Lanure Intense, and this one's in carbon black. This one is my favorite. I don't know, a lot of people don't like it, but I personally, I love it. Um, I feel like it stays on very long. Um, it definitely holds up. It's true to what it says. It's just amazing in all different ways. It's like, you are special. <laughs> but um, here is what it looks like. It's very, very thin, and I love it because you can create, you know, you, it's buildable. Well, the color is very vibrant but there it is and if you want to do more like thin you can definitely do thin it just depends on how light your hand is so yeah I mean this is like my all-time favorite I have tons of the L'Oreal Lanier Intense that's just how how much I use it absolutely love this one this is my number one favorite liquid liner but um, the one that I have been recently loving I have a new love and it's the Laura Geller Beauty Ingenuity um, eye calligraphy and it's the classic tip liquid liner in black it's this one right here and I actually actually got this one for free when I purchased my um, Laura Geller uh, baked balance and bright foundations and um, yeah I got this one for free so I was like really excited to try it out and like I said I absolutely fell in love with it so um, this is perfect for those of us who are just starting out in my opinion because it's already you know you don't have to dip it you don't have to like worry about any of that mess because sometimes um liquid liners like these that comes with like the tube and you have to like dip it can be a little difficult to apply it can be messy you can get all over your eye it's okay keep practicing in my opinion keep practicing because i definitely kept practicing but um i'm gonna be using this because i feel like again it's a little more easy you're you have a little more stability when you're applying it so um let me go ahead and just come closer for you guys let me just go ahead and like clear there we go okay so the first thing that you're going to do don't make that face <laughs> that's not the first thing you're going to do i just need my mirror so i'm going to be using my elf contouring blush and bronzer mirror and the first thing you're, do you're going to do is go you're going to make a line following the natural shape of your eyelid so i like to start right here right before um, the corner of my eye. And then again, I'm just following the natural line of my eye, the top part of my eye. If we mess up, it's okay. Okay, now I'm gonna keep going and I'm going to stop like, a little bit further than where my natural eye 
line meets just a little bit so right there is perfect you see that so my natural eye the line of my eye ends right there and I just brought it out just a little bit more so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take where the bottom part of my um, water line the outside of my line meets right there and I'm going to basically connect that part and then I'm going to connect it to the first line I made so there we go and now what I'm going to do is now I want a wing so I'm going to extend it and I'm going to start with the bottom part of the eye the bottom line that I made and I'm actually going to extend it like that and now I'm going to take the corner or the where the end of that line meets I'm going to bring it back like that There we go, I connected it all. So now that it's all connected, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm going to add a little bit of thickness. So what I did is I took pretty much um, this part right here, like the right before the line ends, like my natural eye line shape, <laughs> the natural line of my sh eye um, shape where it ends right here and I just basically um, extended it a little more and I went like that and if it doesn't look precise or a perfect wing liner it's because I kind of made a little boo-boo <laughs> um, I brought this down a little bit further than what I should have but again that can all be fixed so there we go and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my eyeliner and I'm going to finish up drawing the rest of my natural liner All right, so we pretty much finished one eye right there I'm going to go ahead and zoom in if you guys want Sorry for the background noise. I think there's kids that just got done with school and they're like fighting or yelling at each other. <laughs> I don't know what they're doing, but they're, there's some sort of like loudness going on. So that's pretty much that's pretty much it. Um, I think that's really easy to do. Now I'm gonna go ahead and just do my other eye without talking. <laughs> so there we go till this very day I think I've been doing liner for over 10 years now and I can never make it perfect and there's always one that looks uneven but um, I think that's actually pretty good in my opinion <laughs> um. I'm just kind of going back finishing up the rest of my eye I did do it a little bit thicker than what I should have. So again, a little boo-boo. It can be fixed obviously with makeup remover, but um, this is pretty much the complete winged liner using a liquid liner. And there it is, let me go ahead and come closer. So yeah, I mean, I hope this was a very easy, instructed um, 
how to put together a winged liner using liquid liner for you guys please comment below let me know if this would help you guys um, I'm just curious to hear your thoughts if you guys would try this out and if you decide to let me know if it worked for you if it was easy to follow um, all that good stuff so if you guys enjoyed this video please don't forget to leave a like and don't forget to subscribe to my channel that way you guys can see more awesome videos that are to come on my channel and it'll be available to you right away only if you subscribe right now um, and that's pretty much it if you guys want to see how I put together this makeup look that I did just pretty much um, simple face uh, natural face makeup um, then check that video out it should be available to my channel so yeah that's pretty much it i hope you guys enjoyed this video and again as always thank you guys so much for watching i love you guys so much and i will see you guys in the next episode bye guys Mwah.